So with that, okay, she can come. I'll drop her right off and then be on my way. Sure, you know that Amber is always welcome here. Of course she could come. Thank you, but what are your daughters going to think? What do you mean? I know they don't particularly care for her, especially kids. But don't worry, I'll make sure that they treat her right. How long will she be staying? Just for the day, I have to, by the hours, I have to go up, up to New York to, for a job interview, so we might be moving to New York, so. Okay, I'll let the girls know. Thank you, you're a lifesaver. Okay, goodbye. Bye. <sighs> girls are not going to like this. <laughs> Ben. Hi, sweetie. Hey, Mom. What are you doing? Just checking my emails. What's up? Honey, um, I have to tell you something, but you might want to put your computer away when I tell you. What's going on? Is something wrong? No, nothing's wrong exactly. But... I just got off the phone, The um, I was FaceTiming your Aunt Harriet, and, um, and what? She asked us to look over, to look after, um, Amber. My cousin Amber? Yes. And, um, I told her we would. How could you? You know me, Kit, and Amber don't get along? Honey, but I know you don't get along, but can't you just try? She is family, you know. <sighs> Honey, please. I know it isn't easy. If you know it's not easy, you could have just, you could have at least lied to her and said you were too busy. Honey, I can't lie to my sister. Ever since we were little kids, she could tell I was a liar. I'm a, I'm a horrible liar, according to her. Why would she change her mind after, once we hit adulthood? So, you're, how long is she staying for? Just for the day. Oh, thank God. Listen, I want you to tell Kit. No way. Your, it was your idea to have Amber over here. You tell Kit. Fine. I'll break the news to her. But please, honey, please try to be nice to her. I am nice to her. She's the one who's mean to us. Just try, okay? Fine, whatever. I'm sorry. So am I. <sighs> Come in. Hi, sweetie. Hey, Mom. What are you doing? Playing Minecraft. Well, that's nice, but, um, honey, I need to talk to you. Can you put your computer away, please? What's going on? I guess there's no easy way to tell you this. Oh, my God, did somebody die? No, nobody died, Kit. Well, that's a relief. Honey, um... Your cousin Amber is coming today. My cousin Amber? Why? Her mother FaceTimed me and said and asked us to look after her for the day. And you actually said yes? You know me and Naomi don't get along with her? Especially me. Honey, I know, but she's family and I couldn't say no. Why can't you have lied and said you couldn't do it? Honey, you know, you, I had the same conversation with your sister. Good, at least me and my sister think alike. Honey, it's just for the day. Can't you please try to make the best of it? Does Naomi know she's coming? Yes, I just told her. Just try to be nice to her. She is family. But then why doesn't she act like a family instead of thinking that she's better than us? Kid, I know this is hard on you. 
But please, I'm begging you, please, just try to make the best of it, okay? Be nice to her. We are nice to her. Me and Naomi both are. She's the one who's mean. Just because she, you know, aren't a rich and they could have it, she could have anything she wants and she thinks we're trash and everything. Honey, I'm not too fond of her either. Then why are you letting her come over here? Like I said, she's family. I'm trying to make the best of it. Your sister's kind of trying to make the best of it. I need you to make the best of it. Please. <sighs> Fine. But I'm doing it for you. I'm not doing it for her. I could live with that. Thanks, honey. She'll be here in about a few, ten minutes, so. <sighs> okay. Thank you. I love you. Yeah, love you too. <sighs> Ding dong. Come on in, the door's open. Hi, Aunt Kirsten. Hi, Amber, how are you? Okay. Well, I see this house hasn't changed much since I've been here. Well, thank you. That wasn't a compliment. <laughs> oh, okay. So, how are your daughters doing? Good, we, um, they have their own rooms now, so they don't share a room. No, they have separate rooms. Oh, so I guess this house has changed, just not the kitchen. No, the kitchen's the same. But the girls, um, have separate rooms now, so. Okay. I'm gonna go see my cousins. Okay, but please be nice. I'm always nice to them. They're just jealous because I have more than they have. Amber, please. It was nice of us to let you spend the day with us, so can you please at least respect us? Sure, I guess so. Even though you're not as fortunate as me, but okay. Now I can see why the girls don't like her. Who is it? It's your cousin Amber. What do you need? Can I come in? Please? Well, since you said please, I guess so. So you have this room all to yourself, huh? Yeah. And I re we redecorated it. Do you like it? Yeah, it's very pink. Yeah, pink's my favorite color. I picked out the color and the furniture and everything. And I'm happy with what I picked out. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> it's really pink. You said that already. Do you like it? It's a little childish, but... Well, I'm only eight. Well, when I was eight... I had my own computer, I had a TV in my room, my, my, my room wasn't pink, it was like a bluish color. But whatever, to each of our own, right? Yeah, I guess so. You haven't changed a bit since the last time we saw you. Aw, thanks. Well, look, I'm going to see your sister. Where's her room? Across the hall. Okay. Nice talking with you. Now enjoy your pink room. <laughs> Ugh, I can't stand her. Who is it? It's your cousin Amber. Can I come in? You're the guest. I guess you can. Wow, this is your room? Yeah. Do you like it? I love it. It's so, like, grown up looking. Well, I am 13. I love this room. But, I know there's a but coming. No but. I mean, for somebody with your, with, with the budget that your family has, this room is really cool. You really like it? Yes, I do. Better than Kit's room. What's wrong with Kit's room? It's
It's too pink. It's too childish. Well, she's only eight. That's what she told me. You're making up excuses for her? Please. I like your room a lot better. Well, I'm glad you like my room, but don't make fun of my sister, okay? Please? Fine, I'll do it for you, not for her. I guess I can live with that. So what are you doing on your laptop? Oh, just checking my Facebook. You have a Facebook account, too? Yeah, Mom just let me get one. Do you want to be my friend on Facebook? Really? You'll let me? Yeah. You seem nicer, and I don't want to rush into anything, but I think... You think what? I think you and I could really get along. Yeah, but me and Kit will never be friends. Why not? Because she's younger? That, and she's so immature. She's not immature. Kit's a really nice sister to have. I mean, sure, we have our fights, but deep down when the chips are down, she's always there for me. Same as me, same as I'm there for her. So you're defending your sister? Yeah, I guess I am. <sighs> Your sister is such a drip. She is not. She's actually a really good person. If you just get to know her better, no. Your sister's so childish. I bet she still watches American Girl videos on YouTube. She does, but why does that make a difference? Because she's a baby. She acts like a baby. No, she doesn't. If you're going to defend your sister, I'll go talk to your mother and spend the rest of my time with her. Because you obviously don't like me. It's not that I don't like you. you. It's just that you're being really mean about Kit. You're being nice to me and that's nice. But I don't want to accept it unless you're nice to Kit too. Well then I guess I'm not going to be nice to any of you because I'm not going to be nice to Kit. She's such a child. You're the one that's acting childish. Whatever. I'm going to go sit with your mom. Why, so you could brainwash her into hating Kit? No, because she's the only grown-up I see around here. Who is it? It's Naomi. Can I come in? Yeah. Hey, are you okay? I guess so. You were crying. Yeah. Was Amber being mean to you? Mm -hmm. I don't know why she hates me so much. She seems to like you. She did at first, but then she got mad when I defended you. You defended me? Really? Well, yeah, you're my sister, and I don't like people picking on you. That's my job. <laughs> I just feel so awful. Why does Emma be so mean? Just because she has a, she lives in a mansion and everything. I know. I know she's mean. But you and I will stick together. We'll get through this, okay? We'll get through it together. Thanks, Naomi. It's gonna be okay. Who is it? It's Amber. Can I talk to you guys? Please? <sighs> Whatever. We said you could come in, Amber. Sorry. What do you want? Yeah, you gonna make fun of us some more? No. That's what I wanted to talk to you about. I wanted to say I'm sorry for making fun of you guys. Do you have any idea how much that hurt? I can only imagine. I really am sorry. I I acted like such a jerk. Not gonna argue with you there. Look, we're cousins. I think it's time that we become friends. We've tried to be your friend for years. But it's like you always think you're better than us. You're always nasty to us. I know. I had a talk with your mom and 
she made me realize that that you guys are family and no matter how you live has nothing to do with us getting along so I think we should start over what's the catch no catch I just need you to accept my apology do you forgive me Look, let's just start over. Yeah. I'd like that. Great. Sit down. We're, we're about to watch YouTube. To, to watch American Girl videos? No. We're going to watch Six Blind Kids. What's that? Well, it's a really cool channel. I think you'll like it. Okay. I trust your judgment. <laughs> okay, let's watch it. 